Hi then. Um, in my previous video on uh, turning your sketches into calendars, I showed you how to make a basic um, calendar page using Word. Now, I printed out, I finished my uh, calendar, I printed it out, and what we're going to look at now is um, your finishing touches. Now, there's nothing wrong with doing what I've done with this one here, which is using a simple hole punch, taking a piece of string or a piece of ribbon if you've got it handy, threading it through, tying it up on both ends like this or and like this. Just finish this one off now. And there you go, you can see I've got my basic wall calendar there. Okay, and there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. However, if you are thinking of going down the craft fair route, then um, there's a few ways you can make it look a little bit more professional. So here's the calendar which um, we worked on. If I show you the page which we did on the previous video, you'll see for yourself. There you go, see, I'm not cheating. And I'll show you the ways we can actually make this look a little more professional. Now this seeming medieval torture instrument is actually, um, it's a binding machine. You can pick one of these up on uh, a popular auction site, whichever strikes your fancy fairly cheaply uh, and they're really really good for giving a professional finish so now I find it doesn't work too well if you put 12 sheets in at the same time so I'm just gonna put them in three or four at a time and we are pull the lever and it just creates the holes for the binding cones which I'll show you in a minute so that's one set of four Okay, and we've got May to August now. Again, just make sure it goes in the same as the previous. Pull the lever. And now September, October, November, December. Once again, make sure that they go in the same as the previous ones did. Pull the lever. And there you go. And now this is the clever bit. Now you can pick up these binding combs relatively cheaply. Um, a set of 100 A4 ones, it works out as something between 20 and 30p for each comb if you shop around. So what we do is you make sure that the opening bit is at the top, fit them down onto the machine and then if you pull the lever it opens them up so all you have to do is just make sure that your pages are lined up properly Oops. one just came loose of its bindings there bear with me a second there we are, once again, make sure that your pages are lined up properly, just slot them down, and just, there we are, let's make sure that the last page, a couple of pages are being awkward, And there you go. And there you have it. And there it is. Our finished 2020 Port Talbot Sketches calendar. That looks quite nice. It looks quite professional. And, you know, I wouldn't be unhappy seeing that in a craft fair. So, uh, thanks for watching. And, uh, 
Have a great Easter.